Hello guys, what's up? Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. My name is Christine and on today's tutorial we want to look at how to calculate slope of a staircase. We all know that a staircase is a very important component in a building as it helps us move from one level to another. It gives us access. It allows us to access the, the building. So when we are designing a staircase, it's very important for us to know how are we going to calculate the slope. The slope is going to help us have a staircase that is standard and which is going to which is going to be very comfortable for the user now for the staircase slope the slope should be between 25 to 45 degrees and then the formula for us to get this the slope is tan theta which is equal to the rise over the run now the first thing that you need to do is to measure your your run is to measure your run so your run is here where we have the trade and your rise is here where we have the riser. So you need to measure the trade and you also need to measure the riser. If the staircase are uniform, if the dimension of the trade and the riser are uniform, you just need to measure one trade and one riser and then you can use them to calculate the, the slope. But if, the, if, but if they are different, then you need to measure to do the calculation of the slope for each for each step differently now let's look at an example for this case our our rise here is 150 millimeters and our run all the trade here is 250 now once we have the measurement then it's going to be very easy for us to calculate the slope now let's calculate the slope so our slope will be tan theta which is 150 over 250 150 is the rise 250 is the run so if we divide by 150 by 250 we get 0 0.66 so we have tan theta or which is equivalent to 0 0.66 so for us to get our angle theta it will be tan inverse of 0 0.66 which gives us that one degrees so when you are constructing your 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 staircase the slope that angle should be that one degrees that is for a case whereby you have a rise of 150 millimeters and a run of 250 millimeters guys it's very simple as that it should not give you it is not complicated it's very 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 simple guys thank you for your time until next time bye bye